most people are familiar with coronary artery disease where plaque built up limiting the blood flow through those arteries. Same thing happens in the carotid arteries. So those are the two large arteries on either side of the neck that supply the vast majority of blood flow to the brain. So carotid artery disease is a buildup of plaque, so atherosclerotic plaque, which is a conglomeration of fat, lipids, calcium, fibrin, and just cellular debris. And over time, it can cause narrowing of the arteries. Unfortunately, there are no sort of warning signs. So the first symptom of carotid artery disease is a stroke or a mini stroke. Uh, and if, a, if one of those things occurs, it's important to get immediate medical attention. People that have the risk factors, so age, hypertension, diabetes, dyslipidemia, smoking, uh, and they have vascular disease in other parts of their body should probably be screened. Screening can be done with just simply an ultrasound. We can determine the degree of plaque present. And then if there is significant plaque there, we would typically follow that with an MRA or a CAT scan. The gold standard and traditional way of treating uh, carotid artery disease is with a simple surgery called a carotid endarterectomy, where a small incision is made on the side of the neck and we actually go in, open the artery and clean the artery out and then patch it. Sometimes the, the pieces of plaque that we pull out are pretty impressive. We don't see reversal. The best we can really hope for is cessation or lack of progression, slowing down the progression of the disease. Heart healthy diet, uh, fruits and vegetables, and an active lifestyle. So 20 minutes a day, five times a week can significantly improve uh, heart health and general well-being.